This bald man has been around for a long time, killing people in different fashion, but this ends up with Hitman 3. With that, many question the fact that is this game, Hitman 3, the best Hitman game of all time? So today, I will try my best to answer the possibility that Hitman 3 is the best Hitman game of all time. Because who doesn't like killing people? Please don't take that literally. When we talk about Hitman, it's all about Agent 47, the greatest agent to assassinate anyone who he has been given a contract of and kill them in various ways. Now this variety of killing wasn't present in the previous Hitman games, they were limited and not many things that you can do. However, with the new rebooted trilogy that IO Interactive has made on Hitman, there are much more ways and there are much more things that you can do in these Hitman games and that is all is what is present in Hitman 3 as well. With different ways to kill one person, it doesn't limit your creativity to kill someone in the most fashionable way. Again, don't take this literally. You can dress as anyone and kill the dude, you can poison someone or throw knives at someone because they wanted to test your abilities. Or you can be chicken. Because no one can ever suspect that you are the killer. I wonder how no one is intimidated by this guy. Look at his face. He screams, killer. But in Hitman 3, what I love the most is how they let you go in these massive locations and kill one person who's standing in the middle of thousands of people. Or in situations where you need to investigate something in one place and also you have to kill someone. So it's a challenge for you, which is the brightest part of this game. There are certain side missions that you need to complete which is challenging and not only that, the main objective can also be challenging if you want it to. And to further discuss about Hitman 3, I have a special guest who is a fantastic and super energetic Twitch partnered streamer by the name of Fairy who runs Fairy Live Show. Hello! Thank you so much for having me. It's an honor to be here and talking about Hitman like, oh my god. <laughs> so Hitman 3 is the, the, the final game I know you have played. What is the most important thing that you, that you see when it comes to this Hitman game? Hitman from the very beginning, like when you see that Hitman is launching, you are already excited, especially the fans, because it's there so it's so many years uh, this game, and we all love it, especially the ones that have played it since um, 2000. So yeah, it's definitely something that excites us. I think that one of the things that I was most anticipating to see in the Hitman 3, and I know you are gonna love about it like shorter loading Ooh. screens oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thank you io interactive for listening to us finally <laughs> i was i was afraid to die in hitman 2 because uh of the loading screen so i was really hoping that this would not be a matter on hitman 3 and it happened so yeah that's square great Enix. square yeah. Enix. thank you when I saw Hitman 3, I, th I thought it could be very much similar to Hitman 2 because the style was... Do you have? Do you think that there is, is there any difference between Hitman 3 and Hitman 2? Um, there are some people that are saying that Hitman 3 should not be called Hitman 3, but it should be called like Hitman 2.5. Um, yeah, it could be that, but you know, when Hitman 3 came out and this kind of a reboot of the series came out, because we knew the games that, we, that were released on 2000. They were like sequels with story behind it and everything. Help! Help me! And right now what is happening is that we are having missions and we're having places that we're traveling to. So the good thing about playing Hitman now and Hitman 2 and Hitman 3 at the same time is that you you don't have to play all of the other games to understand the game and you don't have to play the other games to understand the story and everything so that's kind of cool the real real differences be, uh, from hitman 2 to hitman 3 there are not so many like the brand new smart camera is there as a new feature we've never had this before um and you can do a lot of other things than take just a selfie and also the fact that you can revisit some of the places and some of the missions not some of them like all of them and you can have uh you can have unlocked things from the from the way that you played it before and everything that is a pretty cool addition too but other than that all we have is like a, a shinier game i would say 
and uh, yeah, brand new missions and so many brilliant, brilliant things. Uh, assassination wise yeah that's the main <laughs> that's the main thing about this game you need to assassinate someone in the most uh, fashionable way possible <laughs> exactly you gotta be fabulous right you gotta be fabulous you gotta wear that chicken suit and kill someone of course, <laughs> of course. <laughs> i'm here incognito you got him 47 marcus <laughs> davis won't be a problem anymore I know you said that Hitman 2, Hitman 3 is not that different. Uh, mm -hmm. But then then what do you think that is, if, should anybody try out Hitman 3 if they have tried out Hitman 2? 100%. You know, if you like Hitman series and if you like assassinations and if you like stealthy games, uh, no matter if the games are kind of similar, you will play them. You know, when, when um, Dishonored, which oh, is yeah. a pretty cool oh, stealthy yes. game, mm -hmm. Dishonored 1 uh, came out, we were all like crazy yeah. uh, about the stealthiness and everything. Uh, Dishonored 2 had some differences, but you know, it was kind of the same game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we but still it, play it and it we still, still love amazing. it. So new stories and new missions and new places to go. We're in a lockdown. We need to travel. So yeah. yes. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> the game gives you a way to travel to different places. What you have to do is is you have to kill, but you have still can travel different places and look at the view while <laughs> sitting inside the homes. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> We talked about uh, how Hitman 3 is better, but I know that you told me about Agent 47 being the love of your life. So, how did you fall in love with, with the man, with the bald guy? <laughs> well, like, easily. It was love from the first... Uh, <laughs> from the first, first sight. I would say, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, well, I have this thing with uh, bald men. Oh. Yeah, second of all, I love the mystery behind him and everything. Uh, and it was like from the very first game that when I saw him, I was like, oh my god, is he real? Well, I was a little bit younger then, so... Oh. <laughs> I tried to find him oh. in a real person. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Never been, no. never met him. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> The dreams yeah, were but, crushed. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's why I try to meet him in every single game that he's playing. Ooh, and uh, all of those women around him, you know, mm -hmm. I love to assassinate them. That's why I'm doing that. With <laughs> <all of them. laughs> no one can oh be heart. with my Agent 47. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> Well, again, thank you so much, Ferry, for coming by. I really appreciate it uh, for giving all the insights, for telling us about, about Hitman 3, for giving your love story. Again, for those of you guys who don't know, Ferry is an amazing Twitch streamer. Uh, the link should be in the description below. You can check her out. Uh, she has a comic book of Twitch, the only comic book of Twitch, and that comic book is absolutely insane. Marvel and DC, please take a look. Uh, and uh, it, it, <laughs> it is something that you definitely will enjoy. There are characters that you can interact so many things can happen and so many things usually happen you will definitely enjoy it you'll definitely love to party if you don't know the word party you will get to know when when you when you when you go into that stream thank you so much and you already have it you know that and it was a pleasure and an honor to be here and especially to talk about my man my, my husband, man. <laughs> man like oh my god it was an honor thank you so much it was awesome well, again, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this one. Do you think that Hitman 3 is the best Hitman game of all time? Let me know in the comments below what do you think about Hitman 3 and other Hitman games and which one is your favorite. Also, help this video by clicking that like button, commenting down below as usual, and do not forget to subscribe to Game & Madness for more awesome videos on games. And I'll check you guys out next time. Bye.